Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Ruby. If you're new here, feel free to subscribe, you know, the drill. Today, I'm gonna be filming a really requested video. I'm gonna be doing my mini purse collection. As you guys know, back in my old room, I had this infamous mini bag wall. I'll post a picture right here of it. Yeah, I love mini bags. I love having a great collection of bags and you guys, wanted to see all of them so i thought i would show you guys sorry i'm like squinting it's like really bright out i'm not going to talk too much about the bags because obviously there's a visual here you'll be able to see all the bags but i'll just say where they're from or whatnot before i get started if you guys are not already check out my instagram as well as my depop because i do sell a lot of mini bags on my depop if you guys like want some i don't know but if you didn't know i like thrift a lot and that's where most of this stuff is from but yeah i have a lot i don't even know how many i have I'm not including like tote bags or anything. This is strictly mini purses. So the first bag I have is a new edition that I recently thrifted and I have yet to wear, but it's this super over the top guess red Y2K 2000s vibe mini purse. Um, it has like really nice like embellishments all over it. There's like so many, but you can see and like on the strap and that has this little like travel tag, which is cute. Anyway. Such a vibe I'm obsessed. Moving on, another guest bag. I actually have like a lot of guest bags. This one, um, a lot of people ask me where it's from. It's from Guess. I also thrifted this. Uh, it's just like this like furry leopard print. I can't believe I actually thrifted this. A lot of these I used I thrifted like years ago when nobody was really thrifting and like it wasn't oversaturated with like so many people. Um, but I did find this. Another guest bag is this classic, more like vinyl-y material, um, tan, neutral, beige, whatever color you want to call this. Mini purse, very classic style. I like the classic look of this one a lot. Then I have a bunch of black purses because obviously essential, looks good with everything. This one is this pleather black purse with a lot of silver hardware. So it has these like loops that loop on the side here. And then it has three pockets actually. So it's like very com compart compart compartmental, 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 com I don't know what I'm trying to say. You know, there's a lot of compartment as you can see. So yeah, um, this one's super cute. Love, love. Oh, and it's from Doll Scale. I believe it's like current mood. Moving on, I have this black mini purse which is just like all this like faux fur black you know you can see it obviously with silver hardware this i actually thrifted as well but it's originally from top shop and i remember i found it like brand new it had like the plastic over this still i was like what the hell who is giving away a brand new really adorable purse i don't know but i took it okay then i have this one from brandy melville it has similar features this is black that like vinyl print vinyl material and then this chain strap which i think is really cute and then it has a little zipper on the back you know more of a edgier look i guess um i don't we're not showing backpacks but i have this mini backpack in here um then i have this cow print fuzzy little mini bag with a velcro kind of buckle there and then it's plain black on the back this one i've also got a lot of questions from this is also thrifted very cute this is a fanny pack i don't know if that counts but that i got off depop i believe um okay then i got this one also at the thrift store it is this I'm pretty sure it's faux Fendi, but like, I don't care. Zebra print, like fuzzy mini bag. So cute. This is one of my favorite ones, even though it's not real Fendi. I don't care, but it's so cute. I love it. This one is another one of my favorite ones. I can't believe I found this because this is when Tide was like just becoming like a thing. It's literally so cute. I don't even know what's the brand. It doesn't have a brand tag on it, but it's this denim patched up mini purse with like grommet detailing and little patches of tie-dye denim i'm just like so obsessed and it has like brown stitching this is definitely one of my favorite because it's like so unique and like nobody has this then i have this one which is a little beat up but i don't wear it that often so it's okay but it's just this tan um xoxo butterfly little purse it has like multicolored butterflies all over it so cute another backpack 
don't know if this counts again. This is from Dolls Kill though. Then I have this plain white mini purse. This again is just like essential. I honestly don't use it very often, but like I'm in my head, I'm like, oh, one day I'm gonna need like a plain white purse and I'm gonna have it. I honestly used to have so many more purses, but I had to like slowly start taking them off my wall to put in like bundles and stuff because I needed to like shrink my collection because I didn't have enough space on my wall. Anyway, then I have this uh, purse, which is also one of my favorites. I don't wear it that often, but I should. But it's like this tan um, strap and then like tan base. And then it has this like woven zebra print going on, which I think is really cool, just the texture. So I really like this. This was again thrifted, but it's by Emma James, Emma James, a Liz Claiborne company. Then I have this one, which I'm sure you guys have seen all over Depop. But there's a ton of companies that resell these type of bags. Um, I've even seen them on like AliExpress and stuff. But I believe this brand called Crypt sent this to me. It's just this um, brown snakeskin mini purse. It's quite, um, what am I trying to say? It has a lot of room in it. So I like it for that and I like that it's brown. Oh, well, before I forget, I have my Prada purse but I broke it, so I have taken it in to get it fixed because that baby was expensive. But um, I have like the classic Prada Sport vinyl mini purse in black. I posted pictures on it on Instagram, but yeah. Then I have this one that has that like Nova check print. This I also thrifted, never wear, I really should, but it's just like cute on the wall, you know? Down to our last three. This one I got off Depop actually. Um, I didn't really have a green purse, so I was like, oh, I'll get this one. I've literally never worn it. I realize it's a little too, like, I don't know, prep not preppy, but, like, prissy, maybe? Like, I don't know, just, like, the, the, this thing, pleated. I don't know, not pleated. I don't know what it, I don't know, it just reminds me of, like, a princess cushion. Anyway, but I still keep it, and it has some, like, chain detailing. Still cute. Then I have this bag, which I also just recently thrifted in a haul. Um, it's this blue suede and blue leopard print mini bag. Like, I can't believe people are giving this shit away. Like, I mean, look how cute it is. So, yeah, I can't believe I found this. Again, so adorbs. And then the last one I have to show you guys is another um, faux fur black mini purse. This one is really similar to the one from Topshop but um, it's different, so I decided to keep it. It's actually from Old Navy. Like, um, I think I need to start going to Old Navy. Um, but it's really cute, and I just think it's different enough that I can justify keeping both. Okay, so those were all my purses I had to show you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna be doing a sneaker collection very soon, but I'm waiting for some sneakers in the mail. Anyway, don't tell my mom. She's gonna kill me once she finds out about my shoes. Anyway, okay, I'm gonna go because clearly I need more coffee. Um, just kidding, but I'm gonna go get more coffee. I'm gonna go for a walk to the grocery store. Um, quarantine life. Um, okay, what is wrong with me right now? I don't even know. I'm talking so fast. Okay, I gotta go. Love you guys. Like, I don't know what is wrong with me. Okay, bye.